So in this problem, we have two conducting spheres. One of them has a charge of 12 nanocoulombs, and the other one has a charge of negative 18 nanocoulombs. And the separation distance between these spheres is 0 0.3 meters. Okay, so the force between the particles is attractive, and it's given by k times the charge of the first sphere times the charge of the second one divided by the distance squared. So if we, if we plug in the numbers, we have k is 9 times 10 to the 9, and the charge of the first sphere is 12 times 10 to the 9 is 9, and the charge of the second one is 18 times 10 to the minus 9. And we divide by 0 0.3 squared, the distance between them squared. So if we just plug in these numbers in a calculator, we find the total force between the spheres is 2.16 times 10 to the minus 5 newtons. And the force is attractive because one sphere is positive and the other one is negative. So now if we connect both spheres with a conducting wire and charge can flow back and forth between them, now they both have the same charge. So one of them is going to have a charge of minus 3 nanocoulombs and the other one is going to have a charge of minus 3 nanocoulombs. Because the net charge was minus 6 initially and the net charge is still minus 6. But 3 on each, minus 3 on each sphere. So the total force again is given by k times the charge of each one times divided by the distance squared. If we plug in the numbers, we get these numbers. And the distance between them is still the same. So if we plug in this into a calculator, we find that the force between the two spheres is 9 times 10 to the minus 7 newtons. And now the force is repulsive.